What's up guys, welcome to Fezzy Fitness, you can turn on the captions for subtitles. Let's start this video with Akeem Williams who just guest posed 7 weeks out and judging by his current condition, he looks to be in a great spot for the Olympia. As a top 6 Olympian from 2020, there is a lot of pressure on him. The breaking news about Akeem is the fact that he's being coached by Abdullah. Yes, that's right, so that's three of Abdullah's athletes in the potential top 10. Brendan Carey, Akeem Williams and Justin. We don't know why Akeem had to switch coaches at this point but thankfully we have 7 more weeks. In case you have forgot, this isn't the first time Akeem will be coached by the crew from Kuwait. Next up is the reigning 212 champ Sean Clarida who guest posed at the same venue. Just when people think that there is no room for any more muscles on his 5-2 frame, he gets even bigger. Victor Martinez went on to predict that there is a big chance Sean will win his second title in 7 weeks time. The more Chris Bumstead dives into his prep for his third Olympia title, the more confident bodybuilding fans get that it's the fight for second place in this division for as long as Chris wants. 7 weeks out, physique update came out hours ago and the champ just keeps getting impressive. Quads look bigger, delts are more capped than last year. The combination of this will make his waist look even smaller than previous years. Who remembers this picture posted by Brion Ansley hours before the Olympia 2017? Brion went on to win his first classic physique title that year and he really had to suffer to make weight back in the day because the weight limit was considerably low. The former champ wants to bring the same crisp conditioning this year with added 15 pounds or so. Making weight isn't gonna be an issue for Brion this year. Amazing to see the most decorated bodybuilder of all time, Dexter Jackson looking so young and healthy as he isn't forcing any more food to maintain that enormous size. Dexter always stated that consuming his meals in the off season was the biggest struggle in his career. Great to see him training and eating for longevity right now. Without a doubt, he is the best looking 51 years old on planet Earth. After beating Steve Kokolo, Ian is considered in a different league and he can certainly be considered a contender to be in the top 6 of the Olympia this year. This is the biggest he has logged with 5 more weeks till on Classic and just coming out of a win will benefit him. Ian's biggest weapon is his ability to get extremely lean without losing much of his pop of the muscles. He aims to be better for the Olympia this year. Have you guys noticed a change in Brendan Curry's training style as he preps to get the Olympia title back? The former champ usually trains under the principle of blunt force trauma but this year he has been focusing on slow controlled reps with big squeeze. The champ is determined to present a physique with greater details this year. Vlad holding his own standing next to the beast Rolly Winkler just goes to show how good he will be in the future. Only 25 years old and qualified for the Olympia on points. This year will give him some good exposure at the big stage and he has plenty of time to get bigger and get more crisp conditioning. Throughout the comparisons at Spain, one thing didn't go unnoticed his huge delts that makes his most muscular extremely dangerous. Hit the thumbs up button if you like the video and smash the subscribe button if you wanna come back for more. Thank you.